Robert. Hey, I didn't want this song. Well, get that song out of there. People tell me, Robert, asked, where was that recorded at? That the Porque Dios Mío, Amor con Amor. Where was that recorded at? That was actually recorded at Rosedale Park. There we go. Good morning, Double R Radio Live on Facebook right now. Be sure and join me live and uh, say hi, Robert. Hi, Robert. Uh, right now, it's, I got several messages telling me, Robert, are you joking about your cat? Well, that's not my cat. That's not my cat. That's my neighbor's cat. Well, these cats that live in my complex, what they like doing, they like going up the palm trees. There's some palm trees here where I live at. They go up the palm trees when they want papa. They go papa. And they go up the palm tree and they start eating baby birds. <laughs> hey, man, I got nothing to do with that. Good morning, Chad. I'm going to have to Cynthia Gonzalez. I mean, it's a bit Roger. Rosalimas, mi primo. Roger, que pasó, primo. Jim Tom, my partner, Jim Tom, Houston, Texas. Elsa Valdez joining me from Mississippi in the casa. There we go. Norma Jean signed Serna. Buenos dias. Let's see, let's see here. Cynthia Gonzalez de Mina says, Hell yeah, great music. El Super Group of Oz. There we go. Josh Vasquez, Houston, Texas in the house. Mary Reina. Good morning, Mary. Anyways, so, my neighbor's cat was walking down the sidewalk, and I noticed this. I, what I didn't notice was this. There were like three or four birds attacking him. The cat was like, Wah! And I was like, what's wrong, game? Why are those birds attacking my neighbor's cat? Leave the cat alone. And um, I didn't notice that the cat had a baby bird in its mouth. And the birds were pissed off. I could have sworn I heard one of the birds going, that's my mijo. That's my mijo. And, uh, well, you know, what are you going to do? Good morning, Charlotte. I'm going to Mr. Olga Elena. I mean, I mean, it's the Elsa Valdez. There we go. <laughs> Pobre gato, right? The cat's hungry. Poor cat, man. El gato. Then he comes to my door, rings my doorbell, and the cat told me, Hey, Rob, you want to have any, have any uh, pico de gallo? Would you, you know, some Louisiana hot sauce para comer este pajarito? And I go, man, this cat, man, he likes spicy foods. Anyways, it is Tuesday morning. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for waking up with me. Um, how about them Houston Astros? Woohoo! Josh Vasquez, you like my cap, dude? You like my cap, dude? Houston Astros. They are the hottest team right now in Major League Baseball. The Houston Astros. They're kicking ass. They really, really are. Now, you know, I've been criticized. I've been criticized. People have told me, Robert, your morning show is an X-rated morning show. I said, no, it's not. It's not X-rated. You know, I talk about sex a little bit, but we don't go like, you know, we don't cross the line here. And I said, no, Robert, your show is X-rated. I said, no, it's not. But uh, that being said, um, I'm going to bring up a fun fact, okay? And listen up, everybody. Listen up. I'm here right now. I'm going to help you with your sex life. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you with your sex life. You're probably going, you are, Robert. You're going to help us with our sex life. I'm going to help you with your sex life. Good morning, shout out to Maria. Ibarra joining me on my morning show. Good morning, Mary. Tell me in good morning, shout out going out to Rosalinda Torres joining me from Milwaukee, Wisconsin in the house. Michelle Ramirez Williams, who says, what? What did you say? What was Michelle saying? Robert, you're the greatest DJ ever. I appreciate that, Michelle. Thank you very much. Anyways, now, here we go. I'm going to help y'all with your sex life. You're probably going, how are you going to do that, Robert? How are you going to do that, Robert? Um, here's a fun fact you probably don't even know. By the way, we are getting ready for question of the day. But here's a fun fact that you don't know that's going to help you with your sex life. Uh-oh, just got a message. That's my grandbaby, baby Mia. Grandpa, don't talk about sex. Mia, Mia, you got to log off. Log off, Mika. No, no, no. You can't listen right now, Mika. You can't listen. Get off right now. Get off. This is adult time. Adult time, Mika. That's my grandbaby. Mika, get off right now. Get off. We're going to be talking about sex. You got to get off. There you go, Mika. Pampa, will you give me 20 bucks? Yes, I'll give you $20. Yes, I'll give you $20. Get off. I'll, I'll, I'll text message you when you're, when you can come back on. Because my grandbaby, she's in the first grade. She's got a, she's got a, 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 a what do you call it? A Galaxy 20 or whatever she got. Man, my, my grandbaby, man, for first grade, man. She's texting and doing all the math. She's sharp. She really is. Now, you're probably going, Robert, get back to the sex stuff. Robert, get back to the sex stuff. We want to know, Robert. Help us with our sex life, Robert. Okay. Do you want to have better sex? Eh. <laughs> They're probably going, Robert, you better be careful, Robert. What'd you say, Robert? Um, I am going to be careful. 
do you want to have better sex, huh? 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 You're probably going, yeah, yeah, I do, Robert, I do, huh? Okay. Here's the secret to better sex. Are you ready? Huh? You know what? No, I'm not going to go. I'm not going to say, no, 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 I'm not going to do it. Let me get to my question of the day, because, huh? You better not do that, Robert. No, somebody's you better tell us, Robert. Somebody's, somebody's getting warned of me right now. I'll kill you, Robert. I'll cut it off. Uh-oh, somebody's threatening to cut it off. I better go ahead and get to it. Now, here's the deal. Good morning, shout out to Maria Lopez. Joining me in my morning, shout out to Yvette, shout out to Now, I'm going to give you the secret to better sex. All right? Not five. Not seven. Sex. Okay? And you're probably, get to it, Robert! Get to it, Robert! Get to it! Um, if you want better sex, scientists have come to the conclusion, if a person wants better sex, you got to have better sleep, which means you got to be well-rested. The older that you get, the more rest you need. So if you want better sex, you got to sleep better. I always thought that if you wanted to go to sleep, you got to have sex. That's the way I used to be, man. Um, uh, honey, baby, can you put me to sleep? <laughs> Come on over here, baby. Put me to sleep. I want to go Mimi. I thought it was that way. But no, I was wrong. No wonder it hasn't been working. If you want better sex, you've got to go to sleep more. you got to sleep more. Power naps. you got to sleep in a little bit so you can be energized and be ready. And once you're ready, you know, ladies, you call your guy, hey, cabron. Hola, si, cabron. Vente para acá, chiquito. You wanted a piece of me, you're going to get a whole lot more than just a piece. You're going to get the whole pie. Right? So be careful what you wish for. Be careful what you wish for. Right, people? you got to be careful what you wish for. you got to be careful. So... If you're having problems with your sex life, sleep more. There you go. So, if you guy get, this is the way I see it. I don't like to, I don't like what I'm saying right now because look, this is the way I see it. If I go to a bar and I see a girl and I want her and I'm drinking my beer and I'm like, man, I want her, man. She's got to be mine. She will be mine. I'm drinking my beer, right? And I said, that's it. I'm gonna go up to her and I'll go up to her. Hey, uh, honey, baby, do you want to have sex? And she's gonna tell me. No, Robert, I gotta sleep. <laughs> I gotta sleep, Robert. I heard it on the morning show. You gotta sleep before you have good sex. Man, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like. How about if I put you to sleep? No, Robert, I gotta have energy first. I gotta sleep. So it kind of kills the mood. I don't want to go up to a girl and tell her, hey, honey, you, I'm gonna give it to you. She goes, no, no, I gotta go to sleep. Kind of kills the app. Kind of kills. It kills the. The, you know, the, the romantic feeling, you know what I mean, man, come on. Be like, you know, a guy takes a girl out for dinner, wine, dinner, mariachis, right? Right? And then you go home and you're ready, right? You're ready to have sex? I gotta go to sleep, Robert. <laughs> I need energy, Robert. <laughs> man, man, I blew $120 on dinner and wine. I blew 120 for nothing. Man, I want something for my money. I better put on some midget porn. Then they go go down there and put on some midget porn. Anyway, I tell you what, it's time for question of the day. Let's get to question of the day. Question of the day, simple, straight to the point. Now, uh, let me see here and there, Robert. Robert, you're so funny. Okay, let me see here. Let me go here. Okay. Question of the day. Um, we all like food, right? We all like to eat. Hey, man. <laughs> we all like to eat. Ain't no doubt about it. So, my question of the day, simple, straight to the point. Everybody likes a good gordita, right? Well, I'll take a gordita, a flaquita, you know what I mean, a negrita, a mexicanita. I'll take whatever. But anyways, everybody likes a good gordita, right? Good morning, shout out to Fred Romero. Joining me in my morning show, I'm in Dora Peña Rodriguez. Good morning, Dora. Good morning. I knew Dora since she was this little. Yes, I did. Anyway, so, we all like a good gordita, right? Guacamole, picadillo, lettuce, tomato, cheese. We all like that. But there's different types of gordita. So, my question of the day, simple, straight to the point. What kind of gordita do you like to eat? You know, um, I thought about this. I thought about this long and hard. And I said, well, what kind of gordita do I like to eat? And I said, well, I like to eat a gordita who's got a sense of humor, a good personality, long hair, morenita. Yeah, that's the kind of gordita I like to eat. <laughs> 
<laughs> Uh-oh, there's my grandbaby. No, Peppa, you're talking dirty. You're not even supposed to be listening to me. I get off the air. Good morning, shout out. Good morning, caballero. Sylvia Sell, who goes, mira, 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 Robert Rivas on the mira, mira. Anyway, I tell you what, it is 8.50 in the morning. Head on over to Robert Rivas Internet Radio Group page right now and answer me, pregunta, por favor. What kind of gordita do you like to eat? And like I said... Me, uh, well, you know, my gordita, I like her morenita, long hair, you know, has a nice personality, sense of humor, and uh, and is also a good cook. There you go. Let's get to going. Let's do some Mary Chapin Carpenter down in the twist and the twist and shot and whatever the hell it's called. Good morning, Double R Radio.